Welcome to Frico Plays in God Mode, Total War Rome 2, where I take my Athenian empiring to the next level. In this episode, well, this is the Anatolia Campaign, Part 1. <laughs> We're taking the cities blocking the way to Anatolia and the road to Antioch. In the first phase of the liberation of Anatolia from the burden of choice. This also marks the start of our conquest of our first empires targeting both Pergamon and... This is the big news, folks. Our propped up superpower disappointment. The Seleucids, whose possession of Antioch is now inconvenient for our Fricosian plans. And so... And so we are planning in this episode to march, starting here in Armenia. We are going to sweep down until we get right here to Antioch, where we will no longer, no longer be gifting the Seleucids with preference as we begin our conquest of the rest of the East, ultimately, starting with Anatolia. For this task, <coughs> we have assembled, well, we've assembled our leader. Our leader will be leading this campaign all by himself, accompanied by, of course, his heavy cavalry. His heavy cavalry is sitting right here, just waiting in case Alexander's needs him. So Alexander, he's going to start right here. And the plan is to work your way up through here and including here and get on up to Antioch. That is the general plan. <coughs> Before we do that though, I want to take a look around at things. See where we're at with our cities. We got anybody that needs any help? I think oh my yes. You see we've got some issues here. I thought we did. I don't want that horse. It'll be a long time before your turn comes around. Always go for civil settlement. All right. Don't want that. If I can eliminate that, please let me eliminate you. I don't want you. Oh, man. Yes, sir. All right. Ah, I'm not having luck with these guys. These guys. Guys. Oh, okay. Guys, this is all right, guys. We'll take this. Uh, all right, whatever. All right. And then we got our muster field. Got that. The way it goes. Then we got a. Uh, oh yeah, we got a workshop. Need that. Need that. Wherever you can get that, you take that. <laughs> and I don't want these guys. And oh yeah, so I I got a lot. I'm I'm not gonna go through all these. I just wanted to go through one set there, so uh, you could see. I still haven't even consolidated my gains yet. So essentially, I haven't even ended my turn yet. Imagine, oh, just terrible. Sometimes I feel guilty, but then I don't. And I remember that I am Frico. <coughs> so looking through that, that's great. And I want to see, does this, uh, I didn't look here. Okay, you're not up right now, but let's let's see. What's, 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 uh, what's Coldros getting here? You're getting that. Let's see. Anybody else got anything? Uh, oh, 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 Dion is. Well, Kodros, I'm not done with you, huh? I missed something with Kodros. Okay. Always go down as far as you can. There you go. <coughs> and Dex Hills? Dex Hills. Oh, I thought you had an upgrade. Oh, no, no. It's Dion, the new guy. Dion. This is, this is Alexandros' this guy. So, Dion, what, what, what are you offering us? We're going to keep on going down this line here. <coughs> All right. And now I just want to uh, take a look here and see what's our situation here. So, so Cremonides, he's still trucking along, and he's going to watch his son, Alexandros, go and take some glory. We'll see. We'll see what happens here. I don't even care about these. Whatever. She's dead. She's dead. She died. She died. Where are you at? 
Why, why aren't we uh, why aren't we moving this uh, young lady up? Can we turn her into a, a general? I want to turn her into a... I want her to be... I don't, for some reason, the lady generals tend to be a little bit ruder, and I like it. I like rude people. They, they amuse me. I've been called rude myself, and I think it's my lack of awareness of the social graces more than anything, but I could actually just be rude. And I'm looking through this, and I'm just not liking these things. I don't need it. When you're in God mode, you don't need any of this stuff. <coughs> it's it's different. So that's, and that's one of the challenges that I'm doing in this game. I'm trying to figure out the maximals when you are in God mode. You know, generally just authority. I'll tell you what, I'll just take, oh dear, I'll just take that. Uh, oh, shots per, oh, that that's good. I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with that. All right, now come on. Can you get in? Can I do anything with you? I still have haven't learned the whole. I'm sure there's things that are still uh, like some of you might be watching and be like, dude. All right, a new political intrigue has development. Now, influential woman. Well, wow, okay. All righty then. Let's see. Uh, send emissary. Political arrange a marriage between a ruling party and one of its rivals. Hmm. Send a diplomat. Send the politician on a diplomatic no, to, uh, no. Send the politician to a troublesome province. Send gift. Score secure promotion. Use your influence to promote this character. To okay, there you go. All right. Uh, all right. Huh. So she's an opportunistic woman. I'm I'm uh, I'm building her up. Uh, wh what's your name there, Pythodorus? I mean, you are a daughter of uh, Clamonides, so we're expecting great things from you. But how do I get you to war, man? To war. All right, seek a spouse. Seek a spouse. All right. You know, I'm just gonna. You know, when the when I get to the next series, I'm going to get into this more. But even for this series, I'll start to get into this more. So, so Pythodorus, what a charming lady. She is a beautiful girl. And uh, she's, uh, is she married? Did that mean that she is married? A show? Oh, oh, here's her husband. And now I have uh, Ergonus. Hello there, Ergonus. Let's get you juiced up. All righty. Let's get you... Uh, yeah, we don't care about any of that. We just want, uh, what do we want? We want line of sight. What do we want? I don't, I don't even care. Oh, come on. Public order. There you go. Public order. All right. What do we got? Uh, secure promotion. Yeah, give him a promotion. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to give him a promotion. Yep. And uh, let's see. We don't want to send a military. We don't want to organize games. Send a diplomat. Spread rumors. Send a gift. No, that's all we want to do with you. Okay. So who else we got going on here? She's dead. And I feel like I didn't even, well, I literally, I didn't even know her. And I feel, f I'm sorry, commodities. I didn't even realize that Alexandrus was your son until recently. So that's, and there's Glaucus. How, how's Glaucus fit into all this? Glaucus, what's your story? What's your, what's your deal? What's your deals? Come on. Glaucus. This all started with the, uh, Etioclus. Well, it didn't start with him, but that's as far back as we go back, I guess, because of reasons. So, Glaucus, what are you doing? You are, you're doing good. Oh, you need some stuff. You need some, uh, uh, come on, where is it? Uh, that'll work. Public order. Can we do anything for you? You know what I want to do? You know what I want to do? You know what I want to do? Alexandros, or commodities. You know what? Let's, uh, commodities, spread rumors. No. Send gift. Do a favor. Okay. Uh, gather support. Yes. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. All right. Now, Alexandros, let's see if I can promote you. Oh, I can secure promotion. Yes. I'm securing. Okay, okay. You do your part with the family. You know, you do what the family needs. You know. Let's see these guys here. What's your story? Do I care? Oh, Cleisthenes, man. Cleisthenes. I love you, Cleisthenes. Where are you at? You're, you're awesome. Let's see. Your career promotion from 
for secure prom promotion for Clystemies? Oh, heck yes. All right, so they're checking out my family members here. And let's see, do I have any? Uh, there's Disciple of Zeus. There's Disciple of Hera. Oh. Got everybody covered here? But Disciple of Zeus. Do we want to hire a politician? Let me say. We're not able to? Are we able to? Uh, you know what? We're going to hire the lady because we are an equal opportunity. We hate everyone. All right. All right, lady. Let's see what we can do for you. Let's uh, let's get you... Uh, uh, oh, my gosh. Armor for all units. I want that. I want that. There you go. There you go. This is this is, this is is the power. So I'm, I'm learning. I'm learning. I got to look at these records. I'm, I haven't even delved into this stuff, but I'll start to... I start to look at this. I really want to know, like, when can I? I want to. Ch oh, a league, twenty percent enables. See, I'm, I'm not getting rid of this uh, recruitment slot there. So, I do eventually want to go over to Empire. And uh, why can't I? Let's see. Why can't I? Imperium level five. Okay, I need an Imperium level 5. Above 65% ru ruling. Uh, I don't know. Are you telling me that I don't have that? Are you telling me that I don't have that? Let's see. What is my, my situation here? Research J. I don't care about that. Uh, Imperium. Imperium. I do not have the full Imperium. I have, wait, I have Imperium level 8. Why am I? I want to be an empire. I don't know. Anyway. All right. With that, let's begin. Let's begin the conquesting. Let's see how we do here. SG2. Alexandros. Let's get you on in and let's do this. Here we go. Yeah, we can take you. We don't even need. We don't need. No. We don't need none of that. We don't need none of that. And then you're dead. Ready for battle. Yep. We're going to move you on up to here. You're the next. You're the next contestant. On the spice is right. All righty then. Auto resolve attack. Ah, oh, yeah, you're dead. You're dead. That is... That is singular and complete. Yeah! Holy malarkey's Batman. Alrighty then. Let's see. But uh, uh, let's not get let's not get lost in the in the vision. Remember where we're going. Gonna go over to Antioch, so uh let's go right here next. And I think we can auto resolve this. Uh, decisive victory, yes. <coughs> this is Alexandros, man. He's getting himself some some good skills, and has he finally? You know what? I I hate to do this. We should have went up there first. You know what? We'll save you. I think we need to take you. I'm sorry. We can't have you. This this road needs to be cleared later. Eventually, we're coming back to Sinope. But we're not ready for that yet. Sinope's got a naval char challenge to it. And we don't even have our naval here right now. All right. All right. We're, we're going to crush these guys up. We're going to crush their hearts and souls and minds and bodies. <coughs> and that's the end of that. And there you go. And we occupied. We hunger for battle. Alrighty then. Commander. Let's go on back over to here. And um, I believe it's Odessa that's our next quarry. Like yep. We're going to have to take out Odessa. And this is the moment. Here we go. Assault. Ah, no, I didn't want to do that. Ah, uh, you know what? Guess what? 
This is going to be a... Uh, I tell you what, this is a bit of a slaughter. I didn't plan on actually having this little battle, but I'm just going to jump in. I'm just going to actually just deploy and just... So, I'm just going to... Yeah, you're just going to rush on up here. Whatever. Yeah, we're just going to do that. Alrighty, so I'm just going to have that guy rush on up, and then these guys... I'll put you in a group and uh, just shell the crap out of them. And then these guys, I just, I mean, this is, this is why we don't show these things, folks. We just, yeah, I mean, it's, it's bad. It's, it's really bad. It's, it's going to be. You know what? Let's, uh, I'll tell you what. Let's hitch a ride. All right. <laughs> this is going to be uh, short lived. All right. Yeah. All righty then. Where's my general? Just keep going. Don't, don't. Just keep going. So, so you get to see this quick, this quick seizure. Our general is under attack. Yeah. Stop that. Just stop. Let's, uh, let's make it fire. And there you go. All right. That's the end of the battle. We we don't need to save that replay. That that. <laughs> well, there you go. This is that was an unexpected little little battle you got to see. We we uh, I was I was not trying to be artful there. Well, uh, Alexandros he was he was just trying to get the job done. He wasn't messing around. So I think we have one more city that we have to take before we get to the Battle of Antioch. Coming up here, folks. That, that's a dead person. This is now ours. This is now ours. Come on. And we're going to do this one. And this is the last one. Let's see. We're going to do the auto-resolve. Decisive victory. You know, them catapult things. I, I got to tell you, these ten catapults. If you, if you are in a position where either you know they're really not going to be threatened or you know you can protect them, I'm telling you. I got to tell you. So, let's move you on up here. Let's do this. And then we're going to move our, our heavy cavalry, too. I'm going to move you on up here. Heavy cavalry. Moving on up here. There's that. And, uh, and then we attack. So where are we at? Alexandros, assault! Oh, 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 hold on. I don't know why I didn't have my heavy cab. Alright, let's try it again. Come on, why the heck? Alright. All right. Ah! Uh, come on! What the heck is going on? I tell you what. Let's do this. Let's back you up. And let's get you as close as we can. And now, let's get you over here. And now... Let's attack. There we go. Okay. 
are going to get this siege. Got them under siege. And now, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to show you the battle of Antioch. First, we're going to save this one. We're going to save this pre-Antioch. And then, yes, we went to overwrite, and then we're going to exit to the main menu, and we're going to load the game. Well, not the game. <laughs> we're going to load the Battle of Antioch. See? This is how we optimize your experience. You are about ready to experience the Battle of Antioch. And we are going to be following the general because he is going to be looking to take control while the artillery does what the artillery does. Murder humanity. Slaughter it. This just devour humanity. Quaking in its it just just devastation and, and awe is what you end up with. So brace yourselves, folks, because you are about ready to see. Well, hold on. Let's just make sure. Because we're not over here, except we are right. Where are we at? We're with the general. I want to make sure that we stay right here. But before we get to that, let's just explain to you the situation here. This is a massive city, as you can see. Fortunately, it is lightly fortified, but I knew it was a massive citadel. So it was going to be extremely challenging just from that perspective alone. They didn't really need a lot of troopers to present a challenge for most folks. However, we're not most folks. We have heavy onagers. Ten of them. Ten heavy onagers. And you can see the setup here. We got our defenses here. We have only one foot uh, foot unit, and that is the general. Everything else is artillery and horses. Even our reserves, all horse cavalry. Horse cavalry will be coming in somewhere around there, somewhere around, somewhere around here. And we'll be bringing them in when we need them. The plan, actually, is this basically, our troopers that are here this is basically, this is our artillery battery. That's how we are essentially looking at this. And the goal here is to keep all of the enemy forces away from being able to touch the artillery. So the artillery can pretty much do whatever it wants. Just shellac the crap out of you. And it's going to open up these walls right up in here. That's the goal. And as it opens the walls, it's going to move these guys up. But they're not going to be surging in. They're just making sure those guys can't come out. Because what happens is these guys just gather all up in here, and then they're just easy pickets for the artillery. But while that is going on, over here, so we're going to be going back and forth with our viewing, it's going to take the general a while. But eventually, his plan is he is going to get on here. He's going to seize this thing. He's going to get on up here, and he's going to just march right on up through the city. Shayer, marching march right up along this road here and then straight on up to right here where are we at right here right up here this is the goal this is where general alexandros will be heading and meanwhile we would we want to show the rest of the world something today so it is our goal that once we breach these walls and we move our troopers up we're going to secure basically a foothold for us to move our artillery up so that we can get it close enough range. We want to take these walls down too, even though we really don't want, need to, but we want to show the world the, the awesome technological power that we have. So, so with that in mind, let's... Let's get on. Let's hit, get on over to to Alexandros. This is just massive. It's just massive. It's beautiful. Let's get on over to Alexandros to start, and let's hear what he has to say. Hopefully, he has something to say.
Uh, all righty. I don't know what the horse guys are doing, but you guys aren't going up, horse guys. What's up with that? These guys are going up, though. And let's go on over to, well, where it can't feel good for these guys. This is where the pain happens. These are the, oh, these are the reserve horse archers coming in. So they're coming in. We don't even need them right now. We're just taking our time. And we're doing what we do. And there we go. Let's see. We've launched our... Oh, we've already breached the wall. See that? We've already... Oh, wow. We've already breached the walls. So that's pretty good. And you notice how we're moving our cavalry up immediately. And these are basically... These are defensive positions. Argo is... You know, these guys are want to send guys out to stop the barrage and... It is our goal. It is our, our sincerest goal and hope to stop these guys dead where they stand to eliminate their possibility from our lives. Look at that. Look at that. Whoa. Here comes the, look at that artillery hit. Boom, 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 boom. Shellacking, wallacking. Nice. That is brutal stuff. Nice. Oh. See, just like I said, they just they bring their guys up. They want to bring them out. Let's see these guys. Let's Let's see what it's like to be them. I don't think these guys know what to do. Oh, just all they can do is hunker down. They want to take the hills, but look. Look what's humming their way. Oh, oh, man. Here it goes. Oh, death, death, death. Oh, that, that last one scared me. Oh, man. Just kidding. This isn't a good place to be, guys. Oh, man. This is their life, such as it was. Oh. Oh! Put out the fire. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. I It had to be done. Choice is just too dangerous. It's too dangerous, guys. Trust me. After we slaughter a, a good number of you, the rest of you are going to love it. Wait till you see the place. Well, you won't see it, but... I mean, you could surrender, and then you could enjoy things. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. All right, let's see. Let's see if the general's coming along yet. All right, general, where are you at? General is already over the wall. Wow, efficient. I don't, I don't, oh, there's some guys still coming up. Wow, so they weren't even challenged. There's nobody here. Wow. So they can just go uh, go in. Oh, and they're fighting down below. This is the general's troops. These are the only foot soldiers we have. And this is kind of like, kind of like, we, we like to do this kind of in-your-face kind of stuff. Watch this supernatural. Oh, elevator. Transporter. Those tents are seriously boned. And here we go. Let's go kill guys. These guys, they 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 wanted choice. This is what choice gets you. Why did you make us kill you? 
We didn't even care about you. Wow. I love these runs. I love just, it's a beautiful city that, we're gonna repair the city, don't worry. I know it looks bad right now, but we will prepare, repair. Oh man. We don't even, we can't even see what's going on, wow. Thank God we're invincible, because otherwise them towers would be murdering us. But when your boss is your boss is just good special effects. That's all you are. Good sound effects. And yeah, thank you. Little drama in our lives. Appreciate it. No effect. No effect. No effect. Got a nice range, though. Still hitting us. Wow. Towers suck. Ten artilleries is definitely the way to go. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, man, we're killing guys now. Some some resistance, some token resistance. Unbelievable. Beautiful, beautiful ride, guys. Just keep it going. Don't, don't, don't hesitate. Th these guys are fit. I mean, this chugga, 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 chugga. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I realize my camera is frozen for this part of the show, so. Yeah, that is what it is. You get an audio visual only. Nice. There's a nice, humble little home. Gonna move our guys in there. Goodbye, 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 Seleucids. We gave you, we funded these guys forever. And and they let us down. They fundamentally let us down. So you see where the king is going. He is, he is in it. Uh-oh, I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Alrighty, so I think I uh, I'm pigging my system right now, folks. So, wow, I'm gonna pause this for a second because if I can't move, y'all can't see what happens. So, I I think that uh, this is where it's gonna end. I uh, you don't get to see the very ending, but really, he was just oh oh, oh hold on, are we un unfrozen now? Are we unfro almost unfrozen there for a second? But then we froze right back up. So, so okay. So I think we're going to end this here. Uh, maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe it's coming back, coming back, coming back. Uh, can I go forward? Can't go forward, can't go backwards. Okay. Okay, so the general is here and the shelling is is pretty intense over here. And we're just murdering guys and we've sent in these guys the horses. So I can't, I can't. All right. So let's ride with these guys. If we're able to. Wait. Oh, uh, you're not riding, are you? I picked the wrong horse. I, I literally bet on the wrong horse. Come on. You just rode through us? Seriously? All right. So where is the action here? Where is the action? Okay, you guys are coming in. Let's sit a ride with you. Oh, come on. All right, come on. Let's make it. Oh, come on. Why? Oh, yeah. You're about ready to take this. 
Stop it. You keep going back. So, he's stuck. That's what it is. And you, for some reason, you bring me back to here. So, basically, that's it. That really is it. I mean, he's going to take this little spot. And then he's going to come up. And you can see that we've already used our, moved our artilleries. And we're moving some more of it up. I don't know if we've begun. Where are we aiming at? Okay, it looks like we've already aimed at the walls there. So let's see that. Look, we leveled that. We just destroyed that. And we're aiming for the walls. This is just a message to everyone. Not even your inner walls are safe. We can move on up and shatter them too. We can choke you to death if we want. Or we could just, right in your face, just march right on up through you. That's what we're doing here. That's what we're doing here now. The boys. Oh, yeah. There they go. They're about ready to take this. I don't think we should take this victory away from them. Just, just, let's get the last charge in. Come on. Uh-oh, you killed a guy. You killed a guy. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Look at this guy. He's dead. Oh, no, he's fine. He got up. He's fine. There we go. Yeah, that's how we do it. That's how we do it. We immortals. Charging ahead. There's the last stand. What the? We are literally fighting elephants. Their last stand is elephants. Not not really good defensive unit. We really caught them with their elephants down. Look at that tower just taking that shellacking. While we slowly finish off these elephants. These elephants are massive. There you go. There's the tower. That's incredible. It's only a matter of time, guys. Only a matter of time. I mean, these guys are tough. Some kind of vicious. And there you go. And there you go. So... We killed 964. We weren't necessarily trying to. Again, we could have. We could have not had our general Alexandros go in, but we love to take him in, and and just get get our guy some points. So we're gonna give you the payoff visualization here, and I think this method that I'm doing here. That I tried. I'm gonna to try to do this exact formula for the next three episodes, and this is this might be the general formula they use for the the Total War series, for, unless I'm doing some some special kind of event thing. All right. So we'll give you we'll give you the. Here we go. Decisive victory. And that's what it was. And here's the visualized payoff. Decisive victory. Occupy. Okay, so now we're going to save this. 
And I'm going to save this as post Antioch. And the next episode. The next episode is going to be leading up to a naval battle, and that will be the Battle of Sinope. And for that episode, we're going to, I think, we're somewhat going to follow the same formula as we are now, but we're going to actually be making, uh, taking a turn before we fight the next battle. So we're going to be letting hopefully some folks build up and whatnots, but you will see the turn that we take and if we have to do any defensive measures we'll have to uh, do those out and that's going to be the next episode which is going to be called uh, well it's going to be called Sinope that's the next episode